Hey YouTube, Shaker and Shinobi here with a review of the Chibi Arts Philip. That's a very simple name for once. Uh, we'll just set him aside real quick to take a look at the box. Um, it's pretty much like the Cyclone Joker Chibi Arts box with the Futo Skyline, except done entirely in green with Philip's name down there and all over the sides and stuff. There's his back. And on the back here, we've just got a picture of the front and back of Philip and pictures in the Revel Gary and their little base area, their lair, if you will. And then a picture of them all going henshin down, stuff like that. So, really nice box art, yet again. And, uh, yes, he's attached to the stand already. And, yes, it does come with uh, the, the stand for the quotes, which are right here. Uh, this one, we've got just a musical note for when he is common singer. I'll go over that later. Um, Sa Kenzaku wa hajime o. Let's begin the lookup. Zoku zoku suru ne. It gives me chills. And then, uh, Nandai Shotaro. What Shotaro? And let me detach him from this. That took a little effort. That just kind of worked. Okay. So, um, let me say this to start. <laughs> His head is very thick, he's got a lot of hair, and it, it weighs his head down a lot. He is impossible to stand on his own, unless you, like, make him look very, very depressed emo face. Which probably isn't too hard for Philip to accomplish, but, um, he's, he's just very, very wobbly. Uh, he comes with no extra legs, so his legs are always like that. Um, he does come with one extra arm, which I will... And the double driver is removable. Um, to get it off, you have to pop his entire head column off. And then pop his arms off. And then take the entire double driver off. Uh, I prefer it on for the pose I'm going to do, so I'm just going to slide it back on. But just want to show that it is removable. Pop that back in, and uh, I'll show off the other arm right now. Let me put his put his head back on first. There we go. The ball joint isn't as tight as I wish it was, so it is kind of floppy because of his head weight. But um, just lay down, whatever. His alternate hand is or arm is this one, a curved arm for various uh, additional hands. He's got a little microphone, a hand holding the stag phone. Painted details on the back, too. There's no, nothing on the screen. Uh, his, his blank book. No real details on the book, but it's there. And he's got a little pointer hand. And, best of all, a very tiny fang memory that I love a lot. Because I have a hard on for fang. And then his other extra hand that's attached to this arm is the uh, one with the Cyclone Gaia memory. And lastly, he comes with two extra heads. A doing a lookup head and a common singer head. So uh, let's just show how to switch the heads real quick. It's not really that difficult. If you own any of the uh, figure arts DBZ characters or One Piece characters, it's a lot like that. Except a wee bit more difficult because I actually didn't do this yet. There we go. So just break off his entire headpiece and then he's got a big hole in his head. I guess he's so smart he just doesn't actually need a brain. So <laughs> take all of his hair off. So now we've got bald Philip, which is just absolutely terrific. Pull out the head column, or the neck column rather. Put that back in there. Uh, pick whatever head you want. Um, I'm not going to do anything with this one, so I'm just going to set it aside. I wanted to take a look at the common singer thing. So just stick that in there. And then put his hair back together. Just like that. And then toss that in there. Hey, now he's common singer, so let's give him a microphone. And uh, yes, Shotaro does do common singer as well, so you can pose them as the common singer da. And stuff like that. I prefer henshin poses myself, but and there we go. Here's common singer Philip. 
being all yo finger finger on za toriga and stuff like that. Um, being all pretty badass. I, the fact that they included this, of all things, is just really funny to me. Um, I don't see too many people posing them like this on their shelves, but the fact that they included it for people that want to is is pretty rad. So let's uh, get him into the final pose of probably his little figure life. Take out the microphone hand. Put in the guy memory hand. And again, pull out his neck column. It seems to stick to the head more than his actual neck. And get his normal looking head. Pop that in there. Puzzle them back together. And there we go. And uh, just like the Cyclone Joker <clears throat> chibi art, you just line up his feet and he just kind of plugs right in there. Not as tightly as Cyclone Joker, unless I'm just kind of doing it a little bit crooked. But um, he does fit in there fairly decent. So just set him down and uh, position his head accordingly. Something along the lines of that. And he is all ready to transform with Shotaro and become double. I'm going to put Fang right here just because Fang's so adorable that I want him on display. And uh, there you have it. That's really, he doesn't come with as much stuff as Cyclone Joker, but considering he's just a person, that's slightly understandable. Here's a Cyclone Joker for con comparison. And uh, here's Philip, or here's Shotaro, even though I didn't review him yet. But uh, he'll be coming soon. So, here is our little trio of gangsters. I did that backwards, but whatever. Um, is Philip worth it? No, sadly. Um, these were actually kind of on the expensive side. Um, I don't remember how much I paid, to be honest. Um, I got it through Rider Proxy. Um, I don't know if like places like Mandrake have them, because I haven't really looked. But um, if you can get this for roughly for, uh, under $30, I would say if you're a fan of Double and like the chibi style, then I would definitely pick it up. Otherwise... Um, I think most people will be content with uh, just Cyclone Joker here. But uh, it's really cool. I'm glad that they did it. Um, I kind of hope they don't do any more riders, so then I don't have to feel like I need to buy them. But um, I got Philip. I got... Oh, there goes Shotaro's hat. Got Philip, got Shotaro, got Cyclone Joker. I'm pretty content with this line as it is. Uh, I like it, but I agree that not everyone really would. So um, take that as you will. Pick it up if you like it. Skip it if you don't. So um, you can check out a written review as well as the epic podcast at RidersRangersRumbles.com. Check out my personal blog at ShukinShinobi.wordpress.com. And, of course, follow me on Twitter at ShukinShinobi. And that is all. So take care and have a great one. Bye.